What's up YouTube? Welcome back to another escapade and welcome all the new subscribers to my channel. I am out in the middle of a field with John here and we have come across a pretty abandoned place. It looks like it might have been a barn of sorts. Uh, so let's go ahead and go in and take a look and see what's going on. Is that a feeding trough? There's another trough right over here. At the back door, I'll probably get the feed in there. That's an old barn. This dirt looks fresh too. Looks pretty run down though. Look. <laughs> Coyotes. Do you hear the coyotes? Eating. Yeah, my hands are cold too. My hands are freezing. Yeah. So what you guys are hearing is a bunch of coyotes off in the distance, and it sounds like they got a meal. That's all that howling and yelling. Okay, so we just heard what we thought was footsteps outside. We're chilling inside the barn, trying to warm up our hands. It's really cold out here right now. If you guys hear or see anything that I don't catch, let me know in the comments below. There is a top section. What do you guys see up there? What is that? Is it the wire? What is that? Oh, look. Used to be a door. Which you would probably push up on, you know? Yeah. A little hinge. That's not a floor. <laughs> Wait, that's my ball. I thought it was a pipe. Oh, that's true, okay. <laughs> it might be a warm in the other room. It'd probably be like heat lamps. Oh no, it's too cold out there. 
Probably it's warmer in here than it is out there. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. It's got like a window in there. Yeah, the top section. Are there any spirits in here? If there is any spirits in here, if there are any spirits in here, make a noise. Is that just me or did you hear the tap? Did I heard something go through the You heard the tap. If that was you that made a noise, make another noise. That was the same tap. I was still. I was too. And that was the same tap that I heard. Let's go outside on that side real quick. And then we'll come roll around. No, on this side. Then we'll go out here and wrap around. I heard two of the same taps, dude. It was on this side over here. That was me. I stepped on something metal. I heard two of the same taps on this side. <laughs> There's a cow walking around that's not happy. for miles because right back around my fingers are starting to cough oh look it's a mud swallow. I saw another uh, bird's nest somewhere else. Right at the tree we were looking at. It looks like it's. It used to be active before the winter hit. <laughs> That's pretty cool. You usually see them under uh, bridges. Out here. Yeah, yeah. Is that barn? Yeah, it's it's warm over here, isn't it? Then over there. Yeah, it's warm over here. Okay. You can see our breath. <sighs> I said that was you leaning on the thing. I thought there was another noise. I heard it creaking. Oh, that wasn't you? The wood creaking? No. Oh, I thought that was you. That wasn't you. That was something else. No. My, my, my was, like, rubbing on it, but it didn't squeak like it does. Okay, yeah, okay. If 
there are any spirits here, make yourself known. I still hear footsteps. <laughs> Do you hear footsteps? Faint footsteps. Still around. More of a round than inside. Yeah, like not inside here. Ah, <sighs> my hands are cold though. I'm gonna go ahead and shut this off for a second. So I can warm my hands up. Tonight is night two of this place because up here in this attic all of my footage decided to be muted. So I'm going to go ahead and head up here into this attic and chill up there for about 15 minutes or so. Let's go. Alright. Oh, bro. Oh, okay, you're already gone. <laughs> Nothing like scaling up a wall. <laughs> I wish I could have shown you guys how I did that. But, <sighs> okay. So, <sighs> so this was the attic. I was doing an EVP session right here. And things were going well. I thought that it was still recording audio. Is it still recording now? Yeah. So I thought it was still recording audio. Because everything was going good. And come to find out, my camera became muted somehow. And I lost all my audio footage. So, I'm back up here in the attic. And it's pretty windy tonight, so I don't know what kind of like paranormal sounds we're gonna hear. But I'm gonna chill up here alone for a little bit with you guys. Are there any spirits in the static? I'm not using a machine this time. And I would just like to talk to you one on one, if that's possible. So you guys can see more of what I'm in. There we go.
I wonder if this floor would support my weight. I didn't want to try it out last time, but... Yeah, I'm doing good, man. I'm going to try to walk on this floor. I don't know if that's safe, man. <laughs> I'm feeling the whole floor shake. No. <laughs> here, do that again. <laughs> I don't think the floor is safe. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's, there he goes, John's hand. Coming through the floor. How does how does this look? Oh sh! How does this look? That's where I am. That's exactly where I am. I want to see what's in these drawers and in these little folders things, but I don't think I'm going to be able to make it. Whoa. Yeah, I'm going to go back. This whole floor is shaking underneath my weight. So I wanted to see what's in that little drawer, but I don't think I'm going to make it, guys. I'm too heavy for this floor. <laughs> I'm too Let me get back to this little <laughs> entrance here before the whole caves in on me. So is there anyone still lingering in this attic that would like to communicate with the living? And like I said, there is a lot of noise going on so because of the wind. So I'm not going to say those noises are any kind of paranormal evidence because they could be anything blowing in the wind at this point. However, if you guys hear a voice, please let me know. That's an interesting setup over there in the corner. <laughs> oh, I'm getting the same tickle that I got at the abandoned mines. But I'm getting the same tickle in my throat that I got when I was there. And I wasn't able to, you know, it made it kind of difficult to breathe. It's not as bad as what it was at that place. But I did get a little bit of a tickle just now. When I was here last, I heard a man speaking in German on my EVP mach machine, on my spirit box. Is there someone here that speaks German? Or sprechen Sie Deutsch? Come here, bitte. V Gates. Vobistu.
is picking up pretty hard. It's amazing how warm it is in this attic. This attic is pretty much livable. And you don't even need a heater, like, you just need some clothes. I'm pretty warm. Even though you can see my, my breath, I've got about, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, about five layers on. something over here though. Hey John, where are you? Oh, okay, so you're out there? Okay, that's what I was hearing. Were you making like a squeaking sound? Okay. Okay. All right, so let's try the English questions then. So again I ask, is there anybody here who would like to speak up into my camera? Just come speak into the light that's shining. Can you move something? Maybe pick up one of these udder milkers? Push a can? You wanted to mute my camera before. Can you do something else? How old is this barn? Do you want to show us that you exist? I just had to catch my breath. <laughs> I don't know if that's a coincidence or not. Sometimes a person can become out of breath when there is spiritual presence. And like I said, I'm not really cold up here. Was there a dairy farm here? that? No, I did not creep. Where did you hear the creep? Oh. 
push the can. I thought I saw it moving out of the corner of my eye. Push the can. What is that? That looks weird. What is that? Oh my god, what is that? Huh. It's attached by a wire onto a broom handle and tightened. I don't know what that's used for. It's very interesting. There's the squeaking again. Did you hear that? Is that the wind? Pushing something against metal? There it is again. There's no animals outside, right? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Just remember how Yeah. Just remember how hard the wind is blowing. That's you know. But that squeaking, I don't know what the squeaking is. If it happens and the wind's not blowing, then we know we got a problem. <laughs> anything outside that window, but I can't really see anything from here anyway. Can you guys see the window in the dark? Nope. Alright, so now I'm sitting in the dark in the attic. For a couple of minutes here. Was that me doing what? I feel like something is about to grab my feet. <laughs> okay, it might be your presence I felt then. <laughs> if you're right in front, are you right in front of my feet? I also feel something behind me on my left shoulder though. I feel a presence behind me on my left shoulder. If that is a spirit, if that is a spirit on my left side behind me, speak into the blue blinking light on the back of what I'm holding here. Tell me your name. I'm going to take my hoods off so I can hear it a little bit better since it's so warm up here. Is there something you want to tell me about this barn?
Was there an accident that happened at this barn? Ooh, dude, did you hear that? The wind had stopped blowing and then there was a knock. Oh, I just thought I saw something in front of the window. Ah, oh. I don't think, if there is a spirit up here, I don't think it likes light. I still feel something behind me, too. So, I do feel a little bit of a presence here. I don't know if I picked up any voices, any EVPs. Maybe you guys heard something that I didn't hear. But I think I'm going to get down and I'm going to let John get up here and see if he wants to hang out up here by himself. <laughs> and you guys get to enjoy watching me try to scale down this uh, wall. So I'll meet you guys down at the bottom. You ready? Okay. <laughs> I don't want to jump. <laughs> this is always the hard part. <laughs> oh, it kind of works. <laughs> I just hope it doesn't fall. how it got up, so I'll get down the same way. <laughs> right? That's logical. Oh. oh, my God. Yeah, that was really easy, man. <laughs> that was really easy. <laughs> that was real slinky. I'm proud of myself for that one. <laughs> All right, your turn, bro. Can I get my flashlight? Oh, it's nice up there. You'll be okay up there. Come on, monkey man! Oh my! Use your foot on the wall. Yeah! <laughs> you got this, bro? No. I'll show you guys what he's having a problem on. I was having a problem on it, too. Oh, yeah, there you go. Use your arms. Whoa! <laughs> you got this, man. <laughs> you <just> dangle. <laughs> oh, well, that's the wrong trick, but... Oh my, oh my. Will he make it? Oh, half of his body is through. I don't know. Yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright. You have fun up there. I'm gonna go wander around the outside while you do that. So this would have been an old water trough. I saw this last time, but again, like I said, the noise, the audio got muted. So this is where the water would have came in from outside, from like a pump or a well, and then poured in through this hole for whatever animals would have been in this barn. Old electrical boxes. Is there a date on here? No, I don't see a date. Walk around the front. 
there are cow that come into this pasture. Probably from an adjacent. Sometimes with these abandoned properties, the barbed wire gives out at certain spots. And the nearby cattle come into the property. And that's what's been rattling in the wind. Right there, it's the roof. Oh. There's another pipe for something. Maybe a drainage pipe? That could have been it. Ooh. Whoa. Is that a shotgun blast? That looks like a shotgun blast. So the squeaking was coming from this side of the building. Okay, so there's this piece right here that's moving in the wind. But it's not making any kind of squeaking. Are you light enough to walk around up there? Okay. Yeah, be careful. I think these are shotgun blasts out here, dude. Okay, so these branches could be... There's the wind. No, I'm not really hearing squeaking. hearing other noises from off in the distance here, but I'm not hearing squeaking. <laughs> then you got further than I did. Yeah, that's why I didn't want to get on it. Because I'm too heavy. You're like, you're like a hundred pounds lighter than I am. I'm <laughs> taking it. Whoa, man. <laughs> Yes. The hole in the roof? Yes. Oh, I was gonna go check the hole. There was a hole that we covered last time when we were here. And I wanted to check to see if it was still covered up. And we covered the hole so that none of the wildlife would fall into it. And it looks like it is still covered up. Yep. Whoa, that barn or at one time before the addition of these other items in here was this a house that's what I want to know and what was I here it looks like there was some kind of wall right there and the door there's door hinges on these things that's why I think that maybe this is a house turned into a barn. 
See, it's got latches and stuff like this. I think this was a barn. I think this is a house that turned into a barn. I don't... I don't think this is a barn always. And here it comes down. Yeah. All right, guys. So we're going to go head back to the car. It's getting a little cold. My fingertips are getting pretty numb. If I see or hear anything on the way back, then you guys will find out here. But if not, I want to thank you guys for coming along with me on my adventure to this barn and seeing if we could see anything up in the attic. I hope that I did catch something. I'm not sure if I did or not. Go ahead and do me a favor and hit that like button. All the new people to the channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss another escapade. And I guess that's for now. I'll see you guys later. I'm out of here.